Many of us out there are asking the question, who am I, how do I succeed, and how do I lead others? Whether in business or in personal life, these are the questions that we've been struggling with. We all have a brain, to what extent we use that is up to us. And within our brain are our fundamental beliefs, the way we act, the way we react, the way we learn, the way we coexist with each other. We can't be like somebody else, we can't succeed like them, but we can take what we've learned from them. I'd like to show you a little bit about who I am, what I've gone through, and why I believe so strongly in these core beliefs of authenticity. I struggled to know what I truly wanted to be and how and where I was going to find my niche in life. I started out by selling and installing garage doors. That didn't particularly suit me and my personality, so I went and I became a phlebotomist. Next I went to endoscopy, which is up periscope for others, and I didn't want to work on that end of people. I loved the medical field, so I decided, all right, I'm going to stick with this a little bit, and I became an EMT. I'm sleeping. Ugh. I moved on and became a sleep tech and did sleep studies on people. That just kind of felt creepy, watching people sleep. And then I sold life insurance. I take that back. I was a financial representative. After figuring out life insurance wasn't for me, I got into the hospitality industry. It is full of insane individuals much like me and I fell in love. I ended up being able to teach sales to all of the Hilton Worldwide brands. There are things that I've never done. I've never sold a kidney for money. I've never actually beat a computer at chess. That robot. And I still am currently looking for a valid sponsor. So why should you invite me to speak to your company, to inspire your individuals, to bring my brand of authenticity to you? Let me give you a little video resume. They'll help you get to know me. I'm lightning quick and can beat just about anybody in a race. Yeah! What? 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 I dance. Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy. Not that kind of dance. I've grown up clogging and teaching clogging. <laughs> I've taken my love of dance into the classroom. And if the whole class feels left out, I'll have them join in as well. What's that you say you want testimonials? I will be happy to supply you some testimonials. First off, let me introduce one of my happiest customers ever. My dad likes to read books, he likes to work hard, and he likes to wrestle a lot. And he's hilarious. He's the best. Next up, my CFO, the Chief Financial Officer and the true boss of the company, Angel. Well, in one word, I would say he's coachable. He now puts the toilet seat down, he uh, squeezes the toothpaste from the bottom up, toilet paper on the top, coming down, toilet roll space in the right direction. But he doesn't need to work on his uh, breathing. He still kind of breathes out his mouth instead of his nose. We're working on that. Next, you'll find a very enthusiastic lady that if I can please her, I can please anybody. I can really tell you about my son Gregory Ross Johnson. He was the cutest little boy when he was growing up. He kept his room clean. He didn't wipe his boogies on the wall. He, he was fantastic, and, and he just keeps his butt. In fact, you would want to see pictures of him. He went to Disneyland with me, and he was the best driver on that. And look at him clogging. He was the best dancer on the entire Western United States. And look at this. He, he... And finally, let me show you a testimonial that's not a threat. It's just a strong suggestion. If you don't hire my grandson, 
You are in deep trouble. I've even considered throwing up a billboard. What do you think? Training is typically synonymous with boring, with time wasting. But training can also be fun. It can be inspirational. It can be motivational. I have a 100% satisfaction guarantee that you'll walk away both happier, more inspired, and with an action plan of doable items that you can take action on immediately and also in the future. Training shouldn't be that fire hose that people shove in your mouth and say, hey, take a little drink from. I believe that we are truly wired for success, whether in our personal, business, or in our spiritual lives. We can find ourselves. We know ourselves. Sometimes we just need a little help in digging through that gray matter and figuring out who we really are and how we can succeed. Sometimes we need to stop worrying about our weaknesses and concentrate on our strengths to really bring about our true strengths. Please take time to look through my website, to look through the messages that I can bring to your organization and your business. And here's wishing you an authentic life and the permission to dream big.